Uh, so the next items I'll be showing you from the other charity shop is the um, that I can't remember. Um, so we, we're finished with Deborah, and we're moving on to the other charity shop. So from the first week to this, the other, to the week that I went to uh, do my shopping with me video. So yeah, first up is the thirty p box that I went into during my shopping with me video and everything in there was 30 pence so i got this meerkat from the box i don't necessarily i'm not necessarily into animals like collecting them um i think the only animals that i think i'll be getting i don't know when would be like a guinea pig simply because i had a guinea pig and he died and just just to remember him by as also a parrot I am going to be getting something like that as well just to remember him by um, apart from those animals that I just mentioned I would only be getting rabbits because I am in love with rabbits for Easter um, so this America I only got it to, so I could give somebody as a present um yeah so that this was 30p from the 30p box and i like i said i'm just going to be giving um this away as a present so so that's the first item from the 30p box and then we're moving on to another item which is this jar so you could use this as a cookie jar or probably not as not big enough for like a whole lot of cookies just a small amount of cookies but you can use it for whatever you want it so um sugar um even salt um or tea bags or coffee it depends so this was 30p from the 30p box and i like the fact that it's plain it's got it's got no design at all on there so I thought I'm going to get this and I'm going to go ahead and do a DIY um, on this. So yeah, so I can either change the color completely or I can just give it a nice clean and then put some sort of design on there. So yeah, I'm actually loving like the just the words on stuff now. But, um, but anyways, we'll see. We'll see. So that's that. So that came with a lid. Um, yeah, so that's that one. The next item from the same box is this milk jug. So this milk jug came from the same box and it's, you know, for 30p, like I said. Um, yeah, so this also don't have any like designs on there. It's very much plain and I again I can go ahead and do some sort of design on there or I can leave it as is um, give it a good old clean and yeah so I can either just use this for like um, tech for decoration purposes or you know I could clean it up properly and use it um, for a spot of tea <laughs> yeah so um, you yeah, know so it says um, Church Hill on the bottom of course it's not very plain writing on there Church Hill England on there so it's not very plain on the bottom guys so um, so yeah that was for 30p and the last item that was for 30p um is this bell so this bell is for third was for 30 p um just a little bell i don't know even why i got it <laughs> just thought there wasn't anything much in the 30p box so i just took i don't know i guess the best stuff um yeah so so it has a little logo inside. I'm, I'm not sure what this make is, but I will find out on the internet. Um, but it does say cold port on inside. It's very small writing, so you have to like... 
<laughs> so yeah, I has other little small writings in there, so I'm not gonna even bother trying to do that to look at what they are. So um although I don't necessarily wear glasses, but I still like it's still if they're really small writing, I really have to like focus. You know, like you have to focus the camera on there on something to really see what it is if it's really tiny. Yeah, so I might just ha ask my, my aunt's friend them for come read it for me. <laughs> I'm just kidding guys, I like to kid. I like to make jokes that probably don't even make sense to you or myself. Just make random stuff up, but that's the way I am. So anyway, so this was for 30p and I'm going to look on the internet um, at the make of it. So to see if it's worth anything. Right, so those are from the 30 baby box and that is from um, my shopping with me video when I went. Um, I know I should have shown the week before stuff but anyways, these are what I had before me <laughs> first. So um, this is another item and this was a pound and I get this little item I didn't necessarily... I wasn't sure of but I just got it anyways so so it's a little ship in inside a glass case and then this bottom bit is wood so um yeah so that's um nice little ship in the bottom in the, I was gonna say ship in the bottom but it's not in the bottom it's in a glass case so um yeah that don't have like it doesn't have any make on it so so that was a pound and this again you can I can either clean it off give it a nice clean and like give somebody as a present but I did I did I gave my husband <laughs> um I'm not sure if he's into ships anyway but he, he thought it was nice so you know um and if he doesn't want it I can always give it to somebody that does so anyway so that was a pound the next item is this so this is still in the box I did open it by the way if you're wondering um, so this is still in the box and that was a pound for that so it looks like a little um, a little plant pot inside or it just looks like one of those um, like a chalice <laughs> type of thing um it, i don't know um but anyways it's um i'm just gonna take it out so you guys can see it and that's what it looks like so it's it's got like some nice little flowers on there and um like little design the and of course the nice little shape that it has these two little things I think they're handles <laughs> I'm not sure they probably weren't finished making the handles and decided to leave the little stumps <laughs> so yeah um so it's it says made in Taiwan so um at the bottom there's a little sticker so let's place that back in the box so this again I could just use I could just give someone as a present or I could just keep it um, you know and it's at the top it does say fine porcelain so yeah and at the front it does have like some writings it says uh, cylin and then it says at the bottom dynasty so So it says, I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm turning it the right way <laughs> for you guys to see it. But anyway, that's what it says. Um, and that was a pound, like I just said. Right, so the last item um, was this. So this, I did not know what it was. I just saw it and I thought it was interesting and i decided to get it and i know a lot of people will know what it is but i don't i didn't 
until I decided to go on Google and Googled like pots with like candle um, stand underneath and it came up with it didn't it didn't like come up with like this particular um, make it you know it, it came up with lots of different like designs and stuff like that different types of um, you know the same things that so it is a oil burner that's what it says on there so it came up with a lot of different oil burners on the internet but not this particular one which I was trying to look for and um, but I'm I'm glad I found out what it was and so it's very heavy and this was only a pound as well I've taken this sticker off well because my little my little son wanted to play with it <laughs> um yeah so he wanted to play with it he wanted to put fruits in there but I have to say no you can't put anything in there because <laughs> It needs cleaning first. So yeah. Um it's a little cute pot though. So it's an oil burner. And you could I could possibly even say I wanted to try and make candles to try and do it in this. Melting it in there. I don't know. But anyways, again I could either give someone this for you know as a present or I would just keep it, clean it up and clean clean it up and keep it so there is a lot of stuff in the charity shops guys like if you're on a budget and if you wanted to buy like presents and stuff for people um they've got both new stuff that's been you know not been used and things that have been used both like these you know bric-a-brac because they call these things bric-a-brac um and like clothes and stuff shoes handbags belts jewelry hats you know you name it they even have like bits of furniture in them and again if you wanted to go ahead go in one get something like a like a side table or something and like a proper wooden side table side table you know sand it down wipe it down sand it down brush really the um dust and stuff from the sanding and then go ahead and um i don't know like re um paint it or spray it or whatever you decided to do with it um you know they could do stuff like that um yeah, that's another thing that I might try and do one at a time, but that's another story. <laughs> yeah, guys, so the next item I'll, items I'll be showing you is the ones that I got the week before um, from the charity shop that I don't remember the name of. <laughs> I keep saying that. I know. I know. It's probably annoying. Um, anyway, so this item first up is this so this is a puzzle sorry it's in bits and it can't necessarily see what it is but it's actually a wooden dolphin so basically they can just take it apart put it back together and I'm sorry that the bits um that's it it's all in bits because I did put them together and then my son decided to go ahead and play with it so I ended up you know well the head um is nowhere to be found and i i still decided to show you guys i you know bought i, I bought it so it's a wooden dolphin and it's puzzle puzzle pieces and it was a pound also for this so this is for from like i said the other charity shop um which was the week before i did my shopping with me video <laughs> before i did my shopping with me video so yeah so sorry it's in bits so um up next is this post box mailbox and this was a pound and that's a wooden mailbox and you can open that bit 
um and it's got that bit at the top and it also it also has that bit at the back so um you can you've got like these little mail inside so it came with three of them um of course that one is blue and then it had a yellow one Matthew. <laughs> um sorry guys it's my son um yeah so i don't know where the other pieces are the other males are but they're somewhere um so I, what i could do with this is just go ahead and change the color of it if i wanted to if my son allows me to do so and i could just use it for like valentine's day um it does it says male at the front but it, it if you flip it around it's it's um spelled Liam on there which is cool <laughs> so anyway so that's a wooden mailbox um yeah and that was a pound oh yeah it says it does say on the back early learning center on there and it has the address which i'm not gonna say so this last item that i got is a wooden frame and what have you done <laughs> it's a wooden frame and it's 18 by 24 centimeter and i like like these metal bits metal design at the four corners and it's from ikea and it also says inside fig fig design i'm gonna say it i was gonna say johnson <laughs> Johansson so it says Ellen Johansson so um yeah that's what it says in there and it's from Ikea so I love the wooden stuff so I could always just leave it as is paint or paint it um you know whatever color I want to and yeah so that is that was a pound for that actually yeah it was a pound so I'm glad I got that. So that was the last item that I got um, from that charity shop, which I will leave the link down below. I will leave the name in the description box down below for you guys. So anyway, guys, I thank you so much for watching. I hope you like my little hair do that I did. <laughs> I tried my best. I tried my best. Um, anyways, I hope you like this video um and i hope you see some of the items that you like and i hope you will give shopping in a charity shop a go not just for you know shopping because you want to shop and you will see items that you like but just for supporting them so yeah i hope you do and Go and if you've got a charity shop nearby or if you've never even been into one, just go ahead and check it out, guys. So they they do got, have nice stuff in there. And I know a lot of Jamaicans are proud Jamaicans. <laughs> and they, um, you know, they are kind of funny about secondhand stuff. But I was and I've learned to, since I've been here, to just to not care about what anyone says. <laughs> just if I... You know, for me, I want to go into a charity shop and buy something. It's up to me. You know, so like I said, they, you can get stuff on a budget as well as supporting the charities that you're going into. So, yeah. And I used to actually work into two charity shops. Three. So, um, anyways, I will see you guys in my next video like this video please like share and subscribe to my video um and i will see you in my next video guys so yeah um thank you so much for watching and um, thank you for all the support by the way thanks to all of my subscribers for the support so my little one is running up and down the stairs and i know what why he's going in the kitchen <laughs> Anyway, guys, I will see you. Bye.